Welcome to this video. In this video you will learn how to capture business process of the car maintenance service using BPMN. What you are now watching is the modeling of participants with pools and lanes. We have customer, the car maintenance company, customer service representative, junior inspector and technician as participants. The process begins from customer who calls for maintenance. The customer representative then schedules the maintenance. On the service day, the customer drives his car to the service center. The junior inspector then performs basic checking on the car. After that, the technician will drive the car to the working floor and then start performing detailed inspection. The detailed inspection involves the checking of tires, brakes, suspension and steering. and power chain. When finished, a 2 km road test will be conducted. If everything goes fine, the technician will print the inspection report. Then, the customer sales representative will issue an invoice. The customer will pay for the service. Finally, the junior inspector will release the car, and the customer will drive his car away. This is how business process capturing works. Let's take a look at some of the key modeling notations. A pool or lane represents a participant of a process. Here are some examples. A start event indicates where a process will start. A task represents an activity within a process. When a task is placed inside a pool, the task is said to be performed by the participant represented by the pool. An intermediate event indicates where something happened between the beginning and the end of a process. In this example, intermediate event is used as a process break, which shows where a delay will occur. Like task, a sub-process also represents an activity within a process. A sub-process represents a group of flow elements within the context as specified by the name of the sub-process. Gateway can be used to split a path into multiple possible paths. Thanks for watching.